And what we saw next, just real briefly, I wouldn't even mention this, but it was on the program. <laughs> L.A. Knight versus Xavier Woods. And I immediately wrote, even for L.A. Knight, I can't do the day thing, but at least they're giving L.A. Knight something. I thought, okay, a nice showcase for L.A. Knight. Wait. Xavier Woods, small package, one, two, three, in two minutes. They beat him in two minutes with Xavier Woods. What has this guy done? And then, after the break, he's walking in the back, and one of the girl interviewers says, well, what do you think about what the f***? And he said, well, hold on. And he sees Ray Mysterio, and he goes over and tells Ray, if you won't fight your goofy son, I will, and I'll be a deadbeat dad too. <laughs> and Ray punches him in the face, knocks him down, says something to him in Spanish, and walks off. And it was rottenly executed, and even L.A. Knight fumfered a couple of words because he could probably obviously tell, okay, I'm getting beat by middle card guys in two minutes, then I'm going to come in and get fucking knocked on my ass by a guy a foot shorter than me. And I, he should have laid there so the girl interviewer could have covered him for a three. What are they doing here? I don't know. You never know. You never know if it's one of those things where they want to humble someone. You never know if it's just the way they want to treat him because of his age. But despite awful booking from this guy's in-ring work, and more specifically his mic work, he's gotten himself over. People are interested in seeing him. But for some reason, that doesn't stop WWE from constantly <laughs> embarrassing him or treating him like a job guy. And I don't get it because I think, again, he's not a young guy. But out of all the people there that they've debuted on TV in the last six months to a year, he has shown potential. He has shown that people get into him. His work is good. His work is solid. I don't get it. It's, it's not like we're saying put the belt on him. He doesn't need to beat Roman next week. Just give him some wins, which I don't know that he's ever had, and let him talk without getting interrupted or having his fucking face slapped for a few months and see what happens. 